What is going on YouTube? It's your man Mr. Lux aka The Merry Gamer and today we're going to be bringing you guys a new player lock video for Vladimir Guerrero Jr. He has an A potential 88 overall for this player lock as you can see his card and his stats down below 96 and 67 with contact versus righty and lefty 85 and 78 for his powers versus righty and lefty he has good vision at 80 and discipline at 97 uh, his clutch bunting and his durability they are what they are not that important for the player lock and his fielding is low but he's a first baseman position so it's not going to be that critical uh for this player lock or for his position uh and you know his speed is what it is he's a big guy so he's not going to have a lot of speed but he does have very good uh hot zones in his contact hitting so let's get into the player lock the lights are on. And here we are, ladies and gentlemen. I believe we are playing in the Rogers Center at the Toronto Blue Jays home field. Yes, we are. Going against the Miami Marlins. And I am currently using the live roster, so you see their records there. Yunjin Ryu, whatever his name is. You see it on the screen. You can read. All right. So he has one star with a 5-2 and two record, 2.62 ERA. Uh, not too bad. Not too bad. So as we go ahead and see him to our first plate appearance, here we go with Vlad Guerrero Jr., up to bat, as you see for the season so far, 337 batting average, uh, OPS of 1.104. And of course, I am using the outer um, PCI. That's why it looks so large. It just kind of helps with uh, tracking. Oh, that's a good hit. That's a good hit. Oh, that's out of here, baby. First pitch Vlad Guerrero sees. He sends it yard. Home run, 392 feet with 94 exit velocity. Not a lot of exit velocity. Usually you want to see it get into three digits at 100 miles per hour or more. But he had enough power to get it out there. So, uh, again, that's where those power numbers come in that we've seen at the beginning of the video. And that was what a, was that a two run? Yeah, a two run homer for him. All right. Catch another quick replay. They always look very good. I love some of these replay angles that they have. All right. Here we go. We're back up again. Bottom of the third. Let's see what we're going to do here. This bag kind of takes a step out, gets itself settled. But yeah, if you guys want my PCI settings, I will be glad to show you these in a, in a future video. I dropped my PCI down a little bit too low right there. Ah, okay. So, didn't track it very well on that, on that at bat. Man, Miami is now up on us by three runs, six to three, bottom of the six as Vlad steps back into the batter's box. We have no runners on base. So let's see if we can at least, you know, do something, at least try to get on base or hit another home run. Let's see. Is this, is this another one? Is this another one? Another one. Yes. Vlad Guerrero with home run number two of the game. He is doing his part, ladies and gentlemen. You know, if you enjoy this video so far, and if you're a Vlad Guerrero fan or Player Lock fan in, in general, you know, give this video a thumbs up, like it. If you haven't subscribed to my video already or my channel at least, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and uh, hit the notification bell so you get alerted when new Player Lock videos become available. Oh, that's a good swing. It was almost identical to the last one. Less exit velocity on this one at 374 foot home run. All right, so we're still down by, uh, we're still trailing, but it's six to four now. We're down by two, bottom of the eight. We are running out of time, ladies and gentlemen, so I don't know if we're gonna have enough time to salvage a victory here. But let's see, uh, get through there. Uh, I didn't make it through. I think we're gonna make the base though. All right, and that should count as a base hit because that was a tough play by shortstop. Let's see, he's gonna give us the base hit for that. Yes, we got the base hit. So, I think Vlad right now, what are we, three for four? I mean, clearly, you know I'm not going to try to steal a base. We do not have the base running speed. We do not have the base running aggressiveness. We don't have a good steal rating, so it'll be quite foolish, especially during this time of the game. We got Marcus Simeon, who um, recently is, uh, what's it, the May uh, Player of the Month. He has a lightning card in Diamond Dynasty, so maybe he can give us some magic here. In an and he here, as we you know, missed with a swing there, so let's see if he can hang in there for us. 0-2 count, it's going to be tough. Of course he strikes out. Your CPU teammates always seem to strike out when you're on base. Up, oh, and the game is over, so it doesn't look like we came through with the win as Miami is celebrating, as we can see. 
Uh, I'm not sure what the final score is. Uh, six to four. So the final score stayed the same. So, but in all in all, I hope you enjoyed this player life of Vlad Guerrero Jr. He did his thing. He went three for four with two home runs, scored three, had three RBIs, and scored two runs. So, if you enjoyed today's video, please leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and hit that notification bell. I'm Mr. Lux, aka the Merry Gamer, and I am out. Peace.